What's up, YouTube? How's it going? Miles Clark here, and um, welcome to my channel, Miles Ahead. So, I just wanted to do a quick intro, you know, give an idea of what the channel is going to be about, and tell a little bit about myself. So, the channel is going to mainly consist of tennis, um, mainly following my tennis journey. I have a couple of series in mind, you know, I feel like I provide a perspective and information that'll be very useful to players. So for instance, one uh, main series would be, you know, following me in my tournaments, you know, and we'd watch some match highlights and I'd give a breakdown of things I did good, things I did bad, and things I can improve on. Also, I can just give you information, for instance, such as how to do something. Like I would share an experience I had, um, break that down, and then what I learned from it, and then give you tips to hopefully make your experience better in a particular thing, such as like college recruiting. So a little bit about me, um, I'm 22 years old. I just recently graduated from North Carolina Central University, go Eagles. And um, yeah, I lived in California pretty much 90% of my life. Um, I grew up, I played three sports. I played soccer, basketball, and tennis. I didn't pick up tennis until I was eight years old. Um, I played tennis very inconsistently until I got up to high school and in high school I would just practice you know with the team and play matches there. I didn't have much of a juniors career so I'd say my senior year of high school is when um, a lot for me changed mentally. Um, that's when I kind of was like okay I think I'm gonna be a tennis player because I was still playing soccer and so since I wasn't at the level necessary yet, I decided to go to JUCO for two years. I'd say JUCO is when I started to really become a tennis player because that's when I strictly just played tennis. So I had a very solid season in both my years in JUCO and I ended up transferring to, um, yeah, North Carolina Central University. I got a 90% scholarship. I spent the next two years of my life there from 2020 up until 2022. After two seasons of Division I tennis, it kind of inspired me to want to play professionally. So in summer 2021, um, I took my game to and my training to a whole nother level. So yeah, 2022 comes around this past season. I got to play one singles and one doubles. Um, and I accomplished um, something pretty major. You know, I said in summer, my goal was to play professional. So I did a lot of training, worked very hard and we played four ACC schools and I produced some good results against them. I beat Wake Forest and Duke and Wake Forest, the guy actually happened to be ATP ranked. So that was a pretty big win for me. Yeah, so it was a pretty solid season. Um, I earned player of the week three times. I earned first team all conference. And, and yeah, our team, we ended up losing in the second round of our tournament play. And yeah, and then after that, I ended up graduating uh, with a degree in social and behavioral sciences. It was uh, just a little bit about me. I'm sure more information will be revealed about me as time goes on. The last thing you need, I guess, is just an idea of how I play. So I'll give you some of my college highlights. It'll be about me um, hope you enjoyed the video my goal is to be a professional tennis player and so yeah I continue to work hard every day and you know we'll get there I'm just doing this to also help me as a player 
and yeah have some people if they're interested to follow along in the journey so um be sure to like comment subscribe turn on notifications so you don't miss an upload and i will see you next time later